Hey everyone, this is self quarantine vlog number one. Number one. Number one. Um, I am looking like a hot mess right now. Uh, Christopher is here with me. Um, we fell asleep on the couch last night watching some movies because we have nothing else to do but watch <laughs> movies and be with each other. Today we just got an email from our job, <clears throat> from our place of work, that we have been temporarily laid off for two weeks <laughs> with no PTO. Um, so we're kind of in this weird state of like not panicking but also kind of we don't know what's going to happen in the foreseeable future. So we're kind of just taking weird measures right now to kind of hunker down yeah, and stay alive for these next three weeks because if you think about it, you know, being laid off for two weeks means that you're not gonna have a great paycheck for the next week or the following week because you're playing catch up. So we're gonna start vlogging just to kind of give y'all some insight as to what's happening with our lives, but we wanna know what's happening with y'all as well because shit's scary. And we have lots of time to edit. Yeah, we have nothing else to do with our lives. So we're just gonna be really much vlogging for y'all. Get ready for some tutorials. <laughs> <laughs> and not just beauty tutorials, get ready for some like making food tutorials oh and my shit. God, seriously, some life skills survival <laughs> tutorials. But we already gone to the grocery store. I've gone to the grocery store three times already this, this past week. Luckily we got paid this week, um, so we were able to actually go grocery shop and stuff. So we're just gonna take you on for a ride and hope that you are interested. I'm pretty sure you're doing nothing at your home. Maybe going for a hike or something. Take me on your hike. Take us on your hike with you, okay? Mm -hmm. All right, we are gonna fix, the, see you very soon. <laughs> fix this mop up and uh, we'll continue the chat. All right, so update, I still have not fixed this hair, uh, but we did run over and pick up some last minute groceries. We are pretty much stocked up on everything. This is our food situation that we got going on. We have, of course, the beer, the essentials. Um, we have eggs, we have a ton of eggs. We have some milk over here on this side. Variety, we have some orange juice, more beer. We are covered on that end. Um, we also picked up some produce here that we are currently just rinsing off. We have more liquor, more liquor and some more uh, vegetables and stuff, things like that, um, that will last a little bit longer. Um, Christopher, how are you feeling about our living situation? <laughs> It's us and eight days together in this house. <laughs> that wasn't a call. That wasn't a call. Guys, I'm about to kick out my roommate. I'm like- So our other concern that we have is that we don't have a washer and dryer in our house. So that's gonna be the one thing every week for us that's gonna be difficult. I mean, we can always hand wash, hang up things on rails, um, or just also reach out to friends and family and see if they have access to a washer and dryer that we could use. But I'm prepared to like hand wash if I need to. I mean, I bought this shit today to hand wash, girl. Oh, girl. Sensitive skin. Yeah. I mean, I think we're gonna have one day since we're both just gonna be here, self quarantine, and just clean the entire house from like top to bottom, like swift for everything. Top to bottom. Top to bottom. I wanna get my makeup room figured out and cleaned yeah, and situated. Yeah. Cleaning all of my makeup brushes is gonna be amazing. Just pretty much disinfecting the entire house. Yep. Yeah, that's gonna be really nice. We're ready. We're ready. This is day one of being laid off and also being self-quarantined and yeah. Crazy time. Now I gotta go help out a friend move, which is crazy. They've been planning this move for a while now, but of course no one knew that this was gonna be happening um, pandemic wise. So I'm gonna go help them out, hang out for a bit. Hi, me again. Okay, so I went back to, actually no, I went to Home Depot and I went to Dollar Tree and Target and I bought a couple things that I knew that I was gonna need uh, for the next coming days. Um, like little things that you would never think that you would need in the house, but like a cutting board is also very essential. Having like Tupperware to store like the food that you didn't need so that way you can like eat it the next day or later today. Um, um, ice cube trays, which I was like, how do we not have any of this um, between me and Christopher? We don't. Uh, I bought a bunch of, not a bunch, but I bought cleaning supplies. I bought like aluminum foil. I bought plastic wrap. And then for cleaning supplies, I bought just like Ajax, um, some bleach and Windex just to kind of clean up around the house. It's nice just to do that while we're kind of in a self-quarantine type of thing. Then I thought more like... Beauty wise, like what do I want for my health to kind of keep me calm and makeup is something that keeps me very, very calm. Um, but also just taking like baths and like listening to music, having a glass of wine, just hanging out. So bought some lavender, Epsom salts, um, and then also bought some spearmint, eucalyptus, Epsom salts, which just helps with like revitalizing and you know, waking the body out, waking the body up, but also like soothing it out and relaxing your muscles. Cause if I do, or if Chris ends up getting sick, we can take like an Epsom salt bath and kind of decompress and let all of that out. I think that's gonna be the last trip that we make to get anything else. Now it's just a matter of finding stuff to do to keep us busy. 
Good morning, everybody. Well, rather good afternoon. It is one in the afternoon right now. I woke up at 8.30 this morning, randomly, after a long night of like drinking and watching Westworld, which, oh, I just started Westworld season one. Um, it's kind of an interesting show for right now. A lot of people say that it gets weirder towards like season two and season three. So today I am going to be cleaning and just getting kind of shit tidy around the house, which is nice. What we have for breakfast today is some fruity pebbles with a little bit of Trader Joe's almond milk. All right, so we have Christopher cooking a little bit of bacon over here. We have some eggs going on. What'd you put in the eggs? There's uh, cream in the eggs. I just told you this. Oh no, it's like, I just see like orange little spots there, but I'm like, oh, it's the yolk. Hold it on. Needs to be blended Hold there. on. Um, I'm putting together this Swiffer that we bought a while back <laughs> that um, I'm finally getting around to using. And I'm gonna Swiffer this whole kitchen floor because- wow. so proud of you. He's so proud of me. I can't believe you're cleaning. <laughs> <laughs> I clean, you just don't see me when I clean, okay? I'm like, who just LOL. cleaned that recently? Did oh, wow, you that does look really amazing. Exactly. Say one more time for the camera? No. Why? Swiffer has never cleaned in her life. <laughs> Uh-huh. Who did all these dishes? Exactly. 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 Um, I have myself a cocktail. A little bit of whiskey ginger. No. Oh, I have a beer. We didn't cheers yet. Why do we have to cheers? No. <laughs> Day two of Corona. Cheers. Corona Diaries. Corona Diaries. Um, so today is day four of, um, no, day three of self-quarantine. All right, I'm already losing my mind, as you can tell. Uh, my, my hair is still a mess, as you can see. I'm enjoying a nice cup of coffee and starting episode five of Westworld, which is pretty crazy so far with like what this whole show is about. Really cute. Today, I'm gonna be cleaning up my room and my makeup room and getting all my makeup brushes clean, which is gonna be so nice. I'm ready to clean out my makeup collection and vlog this for y'all because it has been a video that I've been wanting to film for the longest time. Uh, is this thing on? I'm like, there we go. Oh, hi. Hi. Okay, so I decided to move over to my camera because I bought this damn thing, so I might as well be using it instead of trying to film on my iPhone because, yeah, I'm gonna be here. I have, like, nothing else to do. So I have my camera set up on a tripod. Um, and so I'm kind of, like, feng shui my room right now just to kind of help pass time. I have, like... My clothes, my like clothing rack that I always, that I like have all of my most recent outfits that I wear on the daily. Um, I usually have them hung up on this rack. So I'm gonna move this dresser right here, probably in this spot because I hate waking up to it. Um, it kind of drives me insane because I don't have a TV in here anymore in my room because it was making me super, super lazy and I would just like stay in bed and binge watch Netflix. So I took the TV out, but the dresser looks naked and so it serves no purpose to be in front of me anymore. So I'm going to move that to that side and have my clothes in front of me. So this is the finished rearrangements in my bedroom. I think it looks really cute now. I like the fact that this is up against this wall here because when I wake up, I can just see all the beautiful clothes that I have and it won't uh, be this like depressing drawer right here. Then if you go over here on this situation, it's my laundry, don't, ma don't mind that. Um, I have this random bookshelf that I recently bought because I just needed some more shelves to kind of store things. Um, and then we have my closet that I was able to put away, pretty much organize most of my shoes and some clothes that are up top that I hardly ever touch. So that's nice. I kind of like purged a lot. Um, and then I have a bag of clothes that I stored away that I was going to give away to Goodwill, but I don't think that's going to happen anymore. Now to attempt this mess. This is like driving me insane because not only do I have to like clean up all of this mess, but I also have to go through all of my drawers and pretty much just like purge all of the expired makeup that I have, um, which it's a lot. 
I wasn't gonna drink today because the past two, three days I've been pretty much just like getting wasted and like not vlogging as much, which is why the first two days, like Monday and Tuesday um, of me vlogging, they were really, really short because I pretty much was like in the weird, like depressive state. So I was like, I'm just gonna drink and maybe vlog here and there. I did a lot of cleaning, but also like I was just passed out by like 5 p.m. and then waking up at 10 p.m. So I might pour myself a glass of wine depending how far I get with this, but I definitely want to get most of this done because my makeup collection has been driving me insane. <sighs> this is gonna be the fun part. <laughs> of me cleaning out my makeup I realized that my camera battery was pretty low so I'm gonna go ahead and just charge it right now um, I made a little bit of lunch I had a pizza um, and I'm saving the other half for dinner tonight and then I am going to continue to clean out my makeup collection later but first I thought after I got done eating I wanted to take a shower and then a bath um, I am kind of hurting, my back is kind of hurting right now, so I want to take like an Epsom salt bath and use some of like the spearmint one that I bought, the eucalyptus spearmint, um, and just kind of relax for like a couple hours or two hours and just have a glass of wine, listen to some music, um, and just kind of doze off for a little bit because I'm a little tired after lunch. <laughs> So, I took a well-needed bath. That was really nice. Now it is time to finish just purging all of this makeup. I have like five drawers to go and then I'm gonna start cleaning my makeup brushes. right now okay um so this has been day three of my quarantine it has been kind of great in a way uh, just kind of getting some cleaning done around the house i want to know what you guys are doing if y'all like are y'all cleaning are y'all what activities are y'all doing are y'all hiking what are y'all cooking let me know because i'm curious i want to know maybe it'll inspire me to do something all right everyone i love you all so much don't forget to subscribe to my channel give this video a thumbs up if you did enjoy it and i will see you later bye